cars can kind of almost be, you know, compared to houses in terms of you have to separate the inside from the outside. There's mm-hmm. water at very high speed air trying to push that water inside. Yep. Um, but all the concepts are generally the same. You have gaskets that close and seal. You have pressure equalization channels. You have drain channels and things like that. Actually, a fun exercise for everyone listening at home yep. is when you go into your car next time, yeah. look at how they've done the gaskets on sure. the uh, seal of the door. Sure. There are two gaskets. Yep. An outside seal and an inside seal. Why is that? So the, are you saying one seal is not enough? Well, one could be enough. <laughs> could be enough. If it was perfect. Yes. But it's not going to be perfect. Nothing's ever perfect. Ever. So it's not going to be perfect. So we've got two seals. Even if both if um, if both seals were perfect, mm. um, that still wouldn't work. Sure. The outside one needs to be a bit leaky. Sure. It needs to be just deflect water. And you'll notice the outside one drains the bottom. Mm-hmm. And the inside one is continuous and mm-hmm. seals. Mm-hmm. So that's rain screen principle. Inside is an air seal. Yep. Outside one is a rain screen shedding the surface. Mm. So if you're ever confused about what to look for on window gaskets, there's a handy reference. Yeah.